taste of impurity, and so it will. Oh my god! Oh my god! Nut. So I feel like I don't need it. Dude, 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 dude! Fucking, are you kidding me? It's so sick. This takes a while. Oh my god, look at this. Look at the fucking dunk, dude. It's so cool. My Armageddon brand does four times as much damage as yours, just because I'm pressing brand recall. Basically, there was a Reddit thread recently mentioning this interaction. Well, it's not so much an interaction as the skill gem itself. Brand recall actually states that when you press the skill, it brings all active brands to you, but it also activates those brands one more time. So for something like Armageddon brand, that means every single active brand will explode right on top of you. In my case, I'm running seven brands through the tree, and I'm also scaling a ton of brand recall cooldown recovery through Hierophant and the tree itself. In short, I get a giga nuke coming out from all these active brands every 1.2 seconds, a really great playstyle, and good defenses through Hierophant. Now this is all theoretical. And the Reddit thread itself was actually fairly skeptical, saying that the build had an awkward playstyle, not great DPS, and found it hard to build defenses. Now I obviously don't really trust Redditors. Generally speaking, even with a good concept, people tend to make really shitty builds. So I had to playtest it in a constrained environment, SF Hardcore, Eater Exarch Rush. And in this case, this run finished at around the 6 hour and 50 minute mark, both Eater and Exarch down. Now that's fast, but the most important part, I only dropped below 50% HP mapping a couple of times. In other words, this is a really well-rounded beast of a build, using this concept alone. Mapping-wise, it plays like a pseudo auto bomber when your brand recall CDR is this low. I summon my Armageddon brands at the start of the map, and then when I approach a blue pack or a rare mob, I'll attempt to summon another armor brand, but it has such a fast cast time, and then I'm holding down brand recall, it really made for a really smooth mapping playstyle. So what does this mean? Armageddon Brand is already the single best caster progression build during the campaign. Usually though, it's supplemented with Cremation requiring a 4 link, Death Crate requiring one more skill gem, and then a Flame Wall as well. You gotta press 6 buttons for your single target. Instead of all of that, I simply press an instant Brand Recall and it basically mirrors the damage of Cremation. In maps though, this setup has far more damage than Armor Crema because you have so much more utility as far as your skill gems go. I'll upload the full run too with an accompanying day 2 POV pretty soon, but for now there's a full VOD published on my Twitch, which you can just go check out if you're really curious. Anyways, can't wait for League Start!